Hello, Cyber Sleuths, and welcome back to Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Complete Edition as we run through the first game. So, last time we got the Zaxxon Forum, and we're going to head straight to it. Wow, the place looks nice. Did do a little bit of level grinding, but not much from last time. All right. So we're here mainly looking into account rating. And as I just saw, there's an item right here. Mojiamon metal, okay, Mojiamon. That's uh, the Yeti Digimon. Kowloon level two. All right, so we now have So we got two of our Digimon up to level 7, and Tokomon's up to level 4 actually now, but we can now get into Kowloon level, we can go towards Kowloon level 2. We can also use Function Call, which allows for increasing our <laughs> current amount. I also found out something interesting when I was looking into this game, because a lot of the games, they don't confirm until later what their protagonists are. This game is actually confirmed easily. It's male. Because if you do a base Cyber Sleuth playthrough for Hacker's Memory without linking a cyber sleuth playthrough male the male avatar for this version is connected i'm not kidding i don't know if i've talked about it before but it's fun to see it that way all right wall crack so we've now cracked the level one wall we got a yukimi Botamon, and we get to go up a floor Welcome to Kowloon Level 2. Now, Level 2, we've got our exit portal here, which we'll go ahead and activate. We don't have to activate it, but it's better to know it's there. He's in the way until we can get later on. We've got a way right into the Digilab. And we now have this entire floor to go through. He is right. Having different Digimon types is good. The fact I've only got free type, two free type, Dig or well, three free type Digimon is kind of an issue. <laughs> Ooh, some HP capsules. Nice. Wanyamon, okay. These are some free time. Ooh, extra damage up combo. Nice, nice. Bubble, Terrier Tornado. At that point, it's just looking at the color of his free symbol. Now, Tokomon got Heavy Strike. Nice. Oh, trivia. Which item has the highest value? Alexandrite, Ruby, or Jade? You know what? We'll go with Alexandrite. Mm. 
confusion is a really bad status condition. Dot can also be. Ooh, this first ro wild rookie. All right, let's go for Terrier Tornado. Dealing 3.0 damage because we are both. So we got 3.0 damage from him or damage dealt to him. The reason is because Terrier Mon is both a vaccine as opposed to his virus and I believe if I'm correct it's because his elemental affinity was strong. I don't know much about the elemental affinities myself. Might go hunt you down. Oh, you should have. Yeah, I wanted to give Goblin Mon or Goberry Mon a turn. They keep switching what's his name between Goblin Mon and Goberry Mon. Ooh, we got a speed charge. Nice. Oh, hey, we got Topaz. Two Wanyamons. Okay, we can get a Wanyamon now. They are wind-based uh, in trainings. So I think electric does more damage to them. No, we did get their metal. That's good. That's another metal to go towards uh, the metal man. These areas are expansive. Ooh, another item on the ground. Dodo Mon. SP capsules. <laughs> Oh, a Biomon and uh, it's Prevo. Spiral Twister, nice. Got a speed attachment as well as level ups. That's not bad. All right. What I'm gonna do is grab the item here, and before talking to those guys, we're gonna go back to Mira. Export. What's that? Oh, allows us to go back to the dungeon entrance. We also have just straight up friendship and EXP items. Those must have been from the uh, the DLCs. I won't be using them for a while unless there's a specific Digimon I want to catch up to us. Goblin Strike. Right now, we're early game enough that we don't need. Okay, 
Okay, so Ruby was the right answer for the... Ooh, chain attack combo. Awesome, they bodied him. Eventually, we will be able to get something that'll stop Digimon from spawning as frequently. Goblimon, we could also get a Goblimon. Now, I probably won't get a Goblimon. I don't really care for the Digimon too much. Mainly to me, it's just a uh, way to show off Ogremon easier. And I already have some Digimon I'm wanting to get. <laughs> We could also run from these fights, but I haven't been wanting to run from them because XP is always good. Good job, Koromon, on that attack. Running back as quick as we can is... While using the export probably would have been a good idea. Until we're able to get more exports, I don't want to use them up. Okay, no need to recover. Terriermon could digivolve, but we're not going to do that right now. However... We are going to digivolve Koromon to Agumon, and Sunomon to Gabumon. Of course, I'll show off the evolution of... Again, going up to Rookie, not much difference. Tokomon can also digivolve, I figure. Let's see what your first digivolve is. Yeah, we'll probably we'll de-digivolve you from that. I'm not wanting a Falcomon right now. Bukamon. Yes, I'm specifically doing this to where I get specific Digimon. Okay, so that's Solarmon. think it is it is Renamon okay uh, I'll actually keep that one Renamon's one that I actually want to keep now I could put Terriermon into this this I believe is Unimon but I actually want to get him up to what his so we'll grab Pabumon Wanyamon. Yeah, Wanyamon's the one I was thinking about. Wanyamon's got some really good ones. And I actually want to put Wanyamon in the party for once. And Pabumon can go up into... The new Digimon we just got. Or we just seen. 
But now we have a team full of rookies. Well, and two extra. Actually, due to the fact we now have a data Digimon, we should have new hacking skills. Of course, we need one skill for Wallcrack level one. Once we hit four rookies, we'll get Wallcrack level two. We get code scan for having a data type. Vaccine gives us copy paste. High security has to have ultimates. Free type gives us function call. If we get a free type that's rookie or better, we get function call level two. Which I think is an instantaneous summoning of another summoning of encounters. If you notice, uh, when he went to Gabumon. Instead of staying as an Earth type, which is what Sunomon was, Gabumon is now a fire type. And their signature moves have changed. They don't have the bubbles still. Uh, I think Agumon's, they either... I think the name when he says it is Baby Flame, but I think it's Pepper Breath. And I think the same can be said for Blue Blaster. Some of the moves are their original Japanese names, some aren't. So it's kind of a hit or miss on what you're getting. Looks like there's a Digilab access point up ahead. Oh, there's... Huh. Oh, I bet I know how you get to that item. Instead of going left, which we did at the entrance, I bet it's to the right back here. So we're gonna go back and get that item. Ooh, two Otamamon. Ooh, triple chain attack combo. And at two times damage. Now, Gabumon's weak because he's a virus. Or a data, and these guys are viruses, but Agumon's strong. We also got sleep recovery off of that. Everyone went up to level 5 except Terriermon, who's vastly outclassing them. Oh, the Otamamons have moved back here as well. You should have told me you guys were going to move back here. Oh, double, double vaccine attack. It uses the first, the Digimon that's actually attacking for the... But that's hilarious to see double vaccine attack. We do eventually need to get a virus Digimon as our third. That way we have our bases covered. Yeah, 
Yeah, blue blaster. It is Pepper Breath. I thought it might have Agumon say, like, Baby Flame. Because that is meant to be his move, his uh, Baby Flame. Ah, there's the exit to go get that item. Plus, we can see ahead of us. There's an item off to our right here. There's an item up there, and it looks like we'll be talking to at least one more, two more hackers along the way. Ooh, Lollamon. Okay. See, and this is why we need a virus. Be able to basic attack vaccine Digimon or er, not vaccine uh, data Digimon because I can basic attack viruses and vaccines currently but I can't basic attack a virus or not a virus a, uh, a data Digimon virus to de defeat data. Like, here's Goblimon. Maxine. The data don't do much, but better than using my MP whenever I don't need to. Or they call them SP in this game. Mana point, special point, same thing. Oh, that's even worse for him. I get off two attacks with everybody before he gets one attack. Terrible for him. Alrighty, let's keep going. So we already talked to this guy. Uh, go down here and there should be another item down here. Oh, these two. Wanyamon maxed. Good. Alright, so we found two cases in farm one. Nope, oh, looks like there is another group of them in our way. Capsule C. Okay, so 
That's teaching about a Habumon's maxed, okay? That's teaching about support skills. Oh, um. Here it is. Uh. Here it is. Bullseye. He increases accuracy by 15%. Dragon's Roar increases damage from fire type skills by 15%. Feral Pulse increases speed by 15%. Accuracy and evasion by 1. Alright. Now we'll hit up the Digi Lab. set up the farm island for something else because we just found out it got us two new cases so we'll set it up for finding us a few more so like I said Terrymon could go into Unimon not happening right now uh, Agumon and Gabumon still have a little bit of time Tokomon needs 10% cam level. Huh. Weird that he doesn't have that. Let's switch him out with Bukamon real quick. So you can get cam level pretty easy by having them. Actually, I just realized Renamon's a data Digimon. Uh, let's move around some Digimon then. Alright, Wanyamon will get... Oh! That's the issue. I have to take out Tokemon and Wanyamon. In order to get... Oh no, wait. Renamon's data. I need, uh... Virus, right. Alright, we are going to have to move Tokomon out for a second. Alright, Pabumon's going into Yokomon. Which we already know can Digivolve into Biomon with the right conditions. Wanyamon, what are your levels like? Ryudamon, Kudamon, Galmon. Ooh, I know what Digimon that is. None of these are a vaccine, but I know what two of these are, and they're real. They're natural carriers of the X antibody, meaning they're a lot stronger of Digimon. Dorumon. Now the only issue I have... No. We should be fine... With leaving... Tokomon for now. Because wall crack is just level 1. We get level 2 out of this. We do lose... I think it's we lose function call. But that's fine. I 
actually, we could get another Wanyamon pretty quickly. Koromon goes back down to Betamon, and Betamon can go up into Wanyamon. This is also how I'm going to show that I'm just taking the NXs out of the pool for now. Well, yes, a six would be great to have a virus. I'm not putting a Mega on my team this early. And now we can get a Wanyamon to get the other X antibody really quickly. Alrighty. So, before we go into the next area, this is where we will call it. Thank you everyone so much for watching, and I will see you Digidestins in the next video. Stay digital, y'all!